What's going on guys? It's me, Jenny. And now I'm talking to myself while walking past houses. I'm walking to the store and it's raining. Of course it's raining. I'm convinced that New England is trying to kill me with the constant snow and rain and bullshit. But yeah, uh, wanted to give you guys an update because I know it's been a few days most of the week since I put up a video, and... Wow, this thing's like flipping out on me. Uh, it's just because depression. I mean, it's a usual thing for me. Uh, I was depressed for so long, that's why I didn't do any YouTube for like two years. And... Uh, sometimes I need to be snapped out of it. Like, hey, you're fine, wake the fuck up. And that's... Matt's not mean about it, but yeah, he helps me with a lot of stuff. So I'm back. I'm I'm feeling better. I mean, I managed to go outside today. That's already an accomplishment. Uh, I think the past week, I just I didn't even want to go outside, despite having next to no money left. I spent I spent a good portion of the little money I had left just getting pizza the other day because I didn't want to go outside and that's for one I shouldn't be having pizza and then just also I I don't know that's that's what my depression does to me it makes me make irresponsible decisions like that to avoid situations I will avoid obligations and just get crap that makes me feel better which is a bad way to deal with it when you don't have any money. So yeah. Ooh, crunchy. Ooh, shit. There's still snow all over the place. If you can't see. Yeah, figured I'd fill you guys in a little. To be fair, this is like... Well, I could have gone out yesterday. The snow, like, doesn't melt. So I've just been stuck inside for the past week. And then of course this crap is... Half of it's frozen, so it's ice. And the other half of it is just gross slush. So I really have to watch my step. So yeah. Uh... Dude, should I be giving relationship updates on here? It doesn't feel like that feels kind of private, but that's like the whole point of my thing. This is supposed to be like a video diary more than anything else. Uh, I've worked on stuff with Matt, and we've come to like an agreement where, okay, he's not my boyfriend, but uh, we're definitely really, really close. And honestly, that's fine. I don't need like obligation or commitment from him to make me feel better. Uh, I mean, we're still just as close as ever. Dang, I almost hit my head on. We're still just as close as ever. Still probably way too close sometimes. But, uh, it works. I mean, I'm happy with him. And he says I make him happy, so I guess that's all that really matters, right? I'm happy, he's happy. Uh, I'm always going to have that nervousness of, am I just sort of a burden to him? But I guess, well, when you love somebody, that's a normal concern. My life is a wreck. Homeless. Married, divorced, now Matt. Although at least it's getting better. I mean, I have a place to live and I have somebody I can definitely take care of, me, which is a huge step up from being homeless, living in a car or an RV, and honestly being in a fairly loveless marriage. Did me and her have good times? Yeah, of course we did. It wasn't all bad all the time, but... The bad started outweighing the good for both of us. 
Oh, it's like 35 degrees out here, so I'm getting kind of simple. I'm glad I kept an umbrella, because damn with the rain. I mean, it's not like a heavy rain. I could probably just wear my hood, but then I'd get all foggy. If you're wondering what's up with the headphones and why the audio isn't probably perfect, like it would be if I was just using the headphones, I'm just listening to Death Clock while I walk. Like, I've been in a really, like, metal mood all day. So I woke up at, like, 5 or 6. Uh, after Matt woke up from his nap. And we just, like, started listening to music and stuff. We weren't, like, doing the usual, like, Skype or anything, but... I don't usually share music with people, just because... I have a very chaotic, eclectic musical taste. Like, I just like everything. Like, seriously. And that doesn't overlap with a lot of people. Like, yeah, I like metal, but I'll gladly listen to, like, Lady Gaga and Britney Spears and stuff like that, too. And I know that doesn't, he doesn't only hear that. I just have to keep that stuff in mind when I share music with people. And him is the first, he, with Matt, is like the first time in the past five years that I've, like, confidently shared music with somebody. The box just sitting here on the ground. Mostly because I know, like, some exact things that he likes. Like, uh, we both like heavier metal, death metal, black metal. Uh, symphonic, power metal, stuff like that. So I know I can share that stuff for sure. And then, of course, some electronic stuff, although that gets kind of iffy, because I don't know one from the other. It's all just electronic music to me. And then there's... Uh, what is it? And then there's just the fact that he doesn't like some things, or he probably likes them, but it's just being a hipster about it. Like, I like Metallica. I don't care if they're like the big sellout name in metal. Especially their last album. Holy shit, come on, that was great. I don't know how anybody could be so picky. So I know he's probably just messing with me on that. There's no way he's that picky about it. I think he just doesn't want the embarrassment of, of me being able to say he likes Metallica. Like right now, underneath my hoodie, you can't see it obviously, I'm wearing my ACDC t-shirt. Which he loves because, of course ACDC being like the big name Australian band of all time. And I just already happened to have that shirt before I met him. He, just, he loves seeing me in it. It's like lately I've known I've noticed that uh, my outward female presentation has been strong enough that I can wear male stuff again and still appear feminine, which is great. Female clothes is fine, but. Holy shit, I need some function every once in a while. Things with bigger pockets. It's like I got some cargo pants for when I was going to work at Subway, that which didn't last more than a few days. And I hate to admit it, but they're my favorite pants now, because... Fuck, cargo pants, come on. Who doesn't love cargo pants? Meow? I can't tell if somebody's yelling at me or just meowing in general. Uh, this place isn't quite as erratic as Denver, so I imagine they're not yelling at me. Anyways, this is almost going on 10 minutes now, so I'll just let you guys go. Just figured to let you guys know that uh, I'm fine. I get depressed sometimes, I disappear. Uh, it should never be a permanent thing. I didn't die. I'm not hospitalized. Although there is a hospital, like right up the street here. Yeah, I just have bad days. 
it sucks when they're back to back to back like that, but I'll live. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll have another more proper vlog for later on today. Uh, I have a bit of a channel announcement, so that'll just be like self-contained to a channel announcement instead of a whole vlog. So keep your eye out for that, and see you next time.